Hi, I'm Josh Boardman, customer service rep with Superior Industries. Today we're going to talk about belt tracking conveyor belts. Before you can start your belt tracking, you need to make sure that your tail pulley here is square with the rest of your conveyor frame. Now that your belt is empty and running, you want to start working with the return rolls to ensure that the belt is centered on them evenly. Working from the tail section, you want to check each return roll to make sure that that belt is centered, working your way towards the head pulley. Once you get to the head pulley, you want to do just the opposite, working from the head to the tail so that the belt is running smoothly between your troughing idlers. In this example here, we can see that the belt is coming close to the edge of the return roll. We can see that the belt has now traveled off of the return roll, telling us that the misalignment is happening. To track your belt, you want to use the handlebar training principle. When you steer your bike, the direction in which you want to go is the direction you turn your handlebars. Same goes for belt tracking. The direction you want your belt to go is the direction you shift your idlers. With the belt going away from you, turn the idler towards the left. The belt shifts to the left. Turn your idler towards the right. The belt shifts to the right. You always want to make sure you're adjusting the idlers and return rolls in accordance to the belt travel direction. For example, when you adjust your idlers, you will be shifting them towards the head pulley. But when you adjust the return rolls, you will be shifting them towards the tail pulley because the belt travels towards the tail. After adjustments have been made, run the belt for three complete revolutions. If your belt is running centered and staying on your head pulley, we're ready to move on to the next step. Now that you've started to load material, you want to ensure that the material is landing in the center of your belt. Now that the belt is loaded, start at the tail pulley of the conveyor and move from one return roll to the next toward the head. Then check the idlers while working from the head back to the tail section, checking the belt for misalignment. If further adjustments are needed, shut down the machine, make the necessary adjustments to the idler and return rolls and restart the machine. After adjustments have been made, run the belt for three complete revolutions. Once your return rolls, idlers, head pulley and tail pulleys are all centered, your belt should be tracked. For more information, please contact your local Superior Industries dealer.